Hello everyone, Christian Gagnon here, and today I'd like to take the time to show you how to forward your email from your eXp Realty email address to any other Gmail account you'd prefer to have it sent to. So, the first thing we want to do is make sure we have both our eXp Realty accounts and our account we're trying to forward to signed in, just to make things a little bit easier on ourselves. As soon as you're done that, you're going to come up to this cog in the top right, click on that, and come down to your settings options. Now, you can see up at the top here we have a whole bunch of options, but the one we care about is this forwarding and pop slash IMAP tab. Now, you can see right at the top we have this add a forwarding address button, so we're going to go ahead and click that, and we're going to enter in the email address we want our emails forwarded to. Go ahead and click next and you'll get this dialog box that pops up that lets you know, hey, this is the email address you're trying to send it to. That's the correct one for me. So I'm going to go ahead and click proceed. And it'll let us know that it sent a confirmation code to that email address. Now I'm going to go ahead and switch tabs and you can see in my updates, I have a new email from the eXp Realty team, which is my forwarding confirmation code. Yours could end up in your updates, it could end up in your primary, it might even end up in your spam. So if you don't see it right away, don't worry. It might just have got sent to a different inbox. Feel free to look around or search for it, and I'm sure you'll find it. Now we're going to click on this email, and you'll see about a third of the way down, it says, please click the link below to confirm your request. So I'm going to go ahead and click on this big long link, and it'll take me to this confirmation web page. Please confirm forwarding mail from our eXp Realty account to whatever Gmail account we chose. That's all my correct information, so I'm going to go ahead and click confirm. And it'll let you know, hey, your confirmation was a success but you're still not done just yet. So we're going to come back over to our eXp Realty tab, still in our forwarding settings, and we're going to reload the page. Now, you can see we have a couple new options up here at the top. We have the ability to disable forwarding, which you might want if you ever decide that you don't really want your eXp emails being forwarded to your primary account but we need to go ahead and click right here where it says forward a copy of incoming mail. And it'll show you which email address it's being sent to. And it'll also give you a drop down menu of what you want to do to the emails that are staying in your eXp Realty inbox. So you can either keep them as a copy, you can mark them all as read, you can archive them, or you can just delete them. Now I really wouldn't recommend this last option just in case anything goes wrong. I always prefer to have a backup copy, so I'm just going to choose keep eXp Realty mail copy in the inbox. Now, you might think you're done, but you have to be sure you click save changes here at the bottom or else you won't have anything forwarded and you won't be getting the emails you should. Once we click save changes, everything should be good and should be set up. And that's all there is to it. Thank you so much, guys, and have a great day.